hello guys welcome back to coding cafe so in the previous video tutorial as you know that we have successfully created a profile activity if i show it to you guys so this is our profile activity and we have initialized and cast the fields on our profile activity java file so now in this video we will uh, retrieve the data and you will display it on the profile activity so for doing that you know, know that we need a uh, database reference first so we can say private database reference and let's call it as a profile user ref and now inside let's create the firebase auth also so we can say private firebase auth m auth and let's create another variable a string uh, type variable for getting the user ID so we can call it as current user ID now inside our on create method we can say mauth equals to firebase auth dot get instance first we are going to get the current user ID so we can say mauth dot get current user dot get uid and then we are going to create a reference to our firebase database i mean let me show it to you to the users node and for the user who is going to view his profile when uh, i mean the user who will click on the profile button or you can say the profile option so we can say current user ref Oh, sorry not it is by the name profile user ref okay so you can say profile user ref equals to firebase database dot get instance dot get ref dot child and the child is you know that our user is not and we can say dot child and we are referencing to this specific user who is going to view his profile so it is stored inside the current user id i mean this unique id of that user so in this way we create a reference to that and now we can say profile user ref dot add value event listener new value event listener and make sure to put a semicolon here first and inside this we are going to retrieve data so we can say if data snapshot exists then we are going to retrieve the data so so for the time saving uh, let's go to the settings activity and from here i will simply copy these values since we use it already here so paste it here if you want you can write it okay so for the time saving i just copy from there so the first one is our profile image uh, which we retrieve from our database as you know that this is the unique key let me show to you guys this is the unique key profile image then the username which we are storing inside the string type variable my username and the name of this key is username which is this one okay so make sure to use the same key key values I mean these keys values which are inside the firebase database i mean these both should be matched with each other okay so make sure to do the same now the next thing is to uh, display the data on the on this text field which we initialized here so what we're gonna do come here and we will pair up copy this okay copy this whole and uh, after this we can simply uh, display it so picasso dot with we are on the profile activity so we can say profile activity dot this and the url is stored inside my profile image string type variable so we said dot load this dot placeholder for displaying the default picture in case of any error or loading and then dot into uh, and dot into is our this field which is circular image field so copy it and uh, paste it here okay that's it and the rest is same okay username user prof user status you can see that username user prof user status 
user DOB. So these are basically our fields which we uh, initialized here. You can see that, okay? And uh, one more thing uh, before, uh, okay, first let uh, do some changes here. I mean some additional things which we want to add here is you can add this plus sign and uh, here we can say for the username we can simply write this at the red and then for the profile we can say okay profile name will be we want to display it directly so we can say profile name and then for the status and then the DOB which is date of birth so here we can say date of birth so we can say DOB which means date of birth and then country so we can say oh sorry for that so we can say country and then gender so we can say gender and relationship status so we can say these uh, these are basically just the text which we want to display before displaying the variable okay so we can say relationship and that's it okay so the most important thing which important thing which i want to discuss is about the picasso library okay so first let uh, me let me show to you guys the library as you know that uh, this is the library version at the time uh, i mean when i am recording this video this is the picasso library version which is 2.5.2 this is the old version because today when i check the picasso library then they have updated the version to 2.7182b so they have updated the picasso library version and if you use this old version i mean uh, which is 2.5.2 which i am currently using so for that you have to write this picasso dot with okay and dot with basically means the context in which we are working which is our profile activity but in the newer version you don't have to write this okay so if you want to use the new version i mean which is our this okay this is the new version which is 2.7.2.71 uh, this one okay so this is the new version if you want to use this then for that you have to write like that okay instead of writing dot with you can simply write picasso dot get dot load the url which is i mean the rest is the same okay instead of dot with you can simply write dot get and the rest will be the same which is dot load dot into and this okay so in the newer version you can simply uh, write this dot get if you want to use the newer new version of the picasso library so for that first of all you have to include uh, this uh, this uh, library uh, this library version inside your module app instead of this 2.5.2 which is the older version you can first include this inside your module app gradle file and then uh, you can simply uh, add this which is dot get instead of this dot with okay so i hope you uh, i mean you understand the thing which i explained here okay so this is very easy task so don't confuse yourself with that so it is totally up to you guys if you want to use the new version so you can simply change uh, i mean you can simply upgrade your version to that so now let's uh, test our app so i'm going to run the app so our app is running now successfully and now let's check our profile activity so i will click on profile oh and it says profile because we haven't set a click listener on that so for that let's first do it so go to the main activity and you can see inside this user menu selector method we have this nav profile which is just dis displaying the toast message profile so we have to create a method to send the user to the profile activity so copy this method which is send user to settings activity and we will change it for the profile activity so instead of settings we can say send users to profile activity that's it and change here also 
to from file activity so yeah that's it and now copy this and you can see we have our this snap profile so here we can pass that method and we can put a semicolon here now let's run our app again so our app is running now successfully if i click on the profile activity now so you can see that it is working fine and it's look beautiful that was incredible so you can see this is the profile picture this is my name which is muhammad ali and this is my username and this is my profile status and you can see this is the country the dob which is date of birth gender and the relationship status so everything is working fine till now so in this way we have successfully added the profile activity inside our this social networking app which is just like facebook twitter and instagram and snapchat and uh, yeah that's it for this video and in the next video we will further work on this cool revolutionary social networking app which we are developing using firebase with android studio so if anyone is new to our channel then please please subscribe our channel coding cafe don't forget to press the bell icon thumbs up for this video and if you have any confu confusion then please let us know in the comment section below and yeah see you guys in the next video and take care of yourself and bye for now